Well, I got some little short thing for you here today, and that is uh, this article about uh, cave art, and they're, they're estimating that it's uh, somewhere between 37,000 and 51, uh, 52,000 years old, and they're, they've dated this uh, by using a uranium uh, method, which is actually a uranium um, sequence series dating method. Uranium uh, element number 92 goes through a bunch of different changes and becomes a bunch of different elements on its way from being element number 92 to being element number 82, lead. Uh, and so it, it has probably something to do with that. I've not heard the term before, but it makes sense. Uh, but of course, uh, there are problems. Uh, they use the underneath the cave drawing uh, uh, substance and uh, above it, which uh, evidently some sort of a, a patina, a glaze, a cave glaze, uh, deposits get on top of something after a long enough time. They could use the thickness of the glaze itself to date it, but no, they prefer the radiometrics because that always gives them the ages that they want. By the way, they searched for over 100 years before they found any uh, methods uh, after Darwin's uh, and, and uh, Lyell's estimations of the age of the Earth uh, to justify that. And now they finally have it, and they've been harping on that ever since. And look at this other thing that bothers me. It says here, you know, there are disagreements about how to collect the samples, so there could be a problem with that. But uh, look at this. It, it, humans could have done it rather than Neanderthals. Again, this persistent, constant, digging their heels in, just uh, 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 refusal to admit that Neanderthals are humans, that lots of humans People today have Neanderthal DNA. Even the evolutionists came up with the idea that red hair uh, first, that 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 uh, drop out of the other colors in a in a semi uh, a decolorization uh, albinism sort of a trait uh, deletion of genetic information and hair color occurred in the Neanderthals. Every red haired person uh, and everyone that we found Neanderthal uh, genes in is an indictment that Neanderthals are not Homo neanderthalensis, they're Homo sapiens neanderthalensis, and extant people today are the variety Homo sapiens sapiens. It's just an extinct tribe of humans. Uh, we found that Denisovans uh, interacted and, and interbred, uh, Cro-Magnons interbred uh, with Neanderthals, so they were people. So the reason why the stubborn cognitive block is in the minds of evolutionists is Neanderthals were one of their most treasured since the 1850s and 60s, most treasured examples of proof of Darwin's theory of the intermediate forms or the transitional forms or the missing link. You keep thinking when they keep anti-thinking. This isn't even just not thinking. This is going against known science and it's for a purpose and they don't know it. So pray for them. God bless Dr. J.